I've put together the 5 best mini PCs that cover value for money, software specs, and features. By watching this video, you'll have a better buying decision when investing in your new mini PC. Welcome to Mr. 5 Things, where we discuss everything about tech, random information, and money-saving hacks, so you don't have to do your own research. Today, we'll discuss the top mini computers for you to buy in 2023. Mini PCs are the same as large computers, but small in size. These PCs have been installed with high-quality processors, making them less capable than larger computers. Mini computers are very elegant and cover much less space for their setup. These PCs come in various varieties with different price ranges depending upon their specifications. With that said, let's get into it, starting with number 1. B-Link Mini S The B-Link Mini S is a mini PC that runs Windows 11 Pro that comes pre-installed. It is available in the market for about $299. Some of the most convincing things about this model include its having an Intel N5095 processor. This is one of the most power-efficient chips produced by Intel. It also has an 8GB RAM built on board, but its RAM is configured in a single channel mode. This means that we cannot get the most out of its processor. This also affects the graphic quality. Additional storage can be added to it. The physical quality of the computer or its body is made of plastic, so the physical look of the mini PC is not all spectacular. It is fitted together very compactly, and despite not using high quality material, the mini PC is well constructed. It has two HDMI ports, which means that it can run two different displays, 4K at 60Hz out of both ports simultaneously. It also has a fan on board which is super quiet despite being under heavy load. Next up with number 2, GMK Nookbox 2. The GMK Nookbox has a built-in core i5-1135G7 with a price of around $479. GMK has a history of putting its users first. With Nookbox 2, you need to know that like most mini computers, it also comes in a plastic body. It looks like alloy, but it's actually plastic. It contains four USB ports which are 8-in-1 ports. It's a core i5. This means it has four cores, which is a lot of power. Its graphics are way better than many other mini computers. Its wireless card cannot be upgraded from the basics. It can be mounted upon a stand and connected to any screen. Price is a big factor when purchasing. The next reviews show that price may be misleading when it comes to what the company offers to its cheaper counterparts. On to the next one. Camrui AMD Ryzen 7. For gamers, this is a mini PC that comes with Windows 11. It costs around $499 on Amazon. It also comes with one HDMI cable and a 12-volt DC power supply. There's also an AC power cable for the DC power supply and a bracket and screws to hang the PC anywhere we want. There are some very neat things about this mini PC. For starters, its physical appearance is attractive. It is constructed of metals on the sides of the body and the rest of it is plastic. It has only one HDMI 2.0 port and one Display 1.4 port. With them, it also has four 2.0 USB ports. It has a processor called the AMD Ryzen 7. This comes with Radeon Vega mobile graphic card and improves its display graphics. Its display speed is 2.30 GHz, perfect for a PC made for use in gaming. It has a RAM of 16 bytes and can be externally supported. This is a light gaming PC and a media server. It can also emulate games, and they run very smoothly without lagging. Our second to last review today, number 4. Desk Elite Mini TH50 Mini PC Mini PCs vary in quality and performance. This affects the graphic display and also the processing of the PC. Mini TH50 is very small in size. It comes with all kinds of accessories to get the setup started. It has a beautiful high-quality display output which enhances the graphics. This PC was a little bit expensive at $500, but trust me, it's worth it. This mini PC has some really cool things, functionally and visually. It looks like it has a metallic body, but it's made of plastic. It has a very small and elegant physical shape. On the front, it has two full-sized USB ports. It also has a full Thunderbolt 4 port. This can also be used as a display output port. On its back, it has a full display port and a full-sized HDMI port. There is also a USB Type-C port which only functions at full power. The Intel Core i5-11320H is a solid SoC and offers a solid basis. Records will not be broken with this processor, but the performance should be sufficient for the intended use. 
Misinforum provided the top model with 16GB DDR4 RAM and a 512GB SSD. 16GB RAM is always installed in the Mini TH50 because it's soldered onto the board. Last but not least, number 5. Bose IIPC Mini Computer, the most expensive PC reviewed, comes in at $859. This PC has a high-end core with 16 threads and is pre-installed with Windows 11. It can easily ensure that all the programs can run quickly and smoothly. It's a good choice for home entertainment, playing games, watching movies, and much more. This mini PC has many impressive features that make it just the right choice for you. It has a very impressive physical build and is designed elegantly. Its body is a light metal so you can barely feel its weight. This mini computer supports 16GB DDR4 RAM, NGFF M.2 high-speed SSD, and the program opens in seconds. While meeting the capacity requirements, it brings several times the speed of growth. Whether it is the system, booting, or program, the speed has been greatly improved. It is equipped with UHD graphics 630 processor and HDMI support 4K. High-definition audio and video, graphic design, and entertainment games show high-definition new picture quality. Therefore, you can use it in the office, in the training center, in the factory, in the internet bar, or wherever a computer can be used. It has a total number of four USB 3.0 ports, four USB 2.0 ports, and an HDMI port. It contains a 2.5 gigabytes per second 1000M LAN Ethernet port. Significantly enhanced functions greatly improve computer performance. It's a built-in full turbofan and efficient heat dissipation to ensure the long-term stable operation of the mini computer. But if you're not interested in mini PCs, you might wonder why we even need these. Well, there are many reasons you should consider these mini PCs. The size of these mini computers has helped us in certain ways. These computers are now easy for us to carry and take any way we want to. Even if talking to a technician, it's easy to carry. It does not require too much space to set up. It can also work with all kinds of operating systems. These mini computers have also reduced power consumption. Longer life or operating time ultimately gives the small computers a sustainability rating. Lower energy consumption has long been demanded by the IT industry. The PCs and servers worldwide have an enormous power requirement, generating thousands of tons of climate-damaging CO2. The mini PCs from Prime Computer AG show that there are other ways of doing things and how computers can work just as effectively with much less power. Mini PCs have no optical drive. Dedicated graphics cards are missing. This means that for some hardware-intensive applications, it's only of limited use. In the end, after years of almost exponential growth in hardware equipment, almost all computer manufacturers have focused more on the hardware requirements of most users. They've adapted their devices accordingly in terms of configuration or expansion options. As the race amongst companies has begun for the creation of the best mini-computer, companies are focusing on the users of PCs. This race can be benevolent for all of us as technology evolves. This will eventually result in better computers for the users. Many PCs are more than just a brief trend as the computer industry has experienced time and again. Many PCs determine more and more IT landscapes, take over more important applications, and in the course of further digitalization, the mini computer has a huge role to play in the future of computers and technology. Many PCs are the future of technology and are now being used everywhere. The specifications lacking in these computers will be covered very soon by the technology companies working to improve these computers. So, have you made your pick? Check them out in the links below and let us know in the comments. We hope you liked the video and thanks for watching.